Mmm, yummy. Ooh. We are at Doheny State Park about to fix the shackles on the camper and Robin has prepared us some tuna fish sandwiches Ooh. that she made uh, a while ago. The tuna <laughs> fish and we've been making sandwiches and the potato salad is compliments of Mamacita. Thank you, Mama. Mm-hmm. So, yum, delicious. And we're going to scarf down and try and fix these shackles. And we're going to try and sneak in a little ride on the Pacific Coast Highway because, dadgummit, we are here. Notice how low the steps are sitting to the ground. One of the shackles for the springs on our camper is broke. Let me show the folks. That should be turned up and attached to the frame of the camper. And it's just destroyed. Aww. Yeah. Crap. We are beginning to change the shackle properly on the camper. As we showed you how it was ripped out earlier, we have new ones. I have new bolts that I need to press fit in just a second, which I'll show you what you're supposed to do. But next thing is, if you're towing a camper, you should always carry, uh, and if you have a diesel truck like we do, a, a heavy duty one ton with a diesel, you need a small three ton jack, because sometimes even a two and a half ton jack is frightening to try and lift the thing, and it'll barely even do it. Yeah. Gotcha. So, there you go. So there's the start. Good jack, good parts. Come out, follow me over here real quick. These are the new bolts, and you'll see that they have ridges on them. You want those pressed in if you can. It'd be nice if I had a hammer, but unfortunately I left a lot of my tools at home. So let's see if I can do this. Most of it pressed in really well. There's two ways we're doing this in a pinch. found out we had a mallet in the bottom of the toolbox. So there's that way. A new way. So this is our bar for our trailer hitch removal system. And we are centering this guy up. Beautiful job. Beautiful. It's more even hitting on all the contact points, huh? Yep, you got it. And that's not ruining our trailer hitch, hopefully. <laughs> no, that's it. Done. See Much the, easier. Okay, so now see this one? Yeah. It's not, popped loose. It's not quite up there. Look at that almost yeah. almost seated almost. nice <coughs> well improvise baby improvise yep all right somehow i need to make that hole and that hole only be about four inches away from each other three and a half inches i'm a little confounded We now have, you can see the new shiny parts, two new shackles on there, and my recommendation is, is to make sure you keep your jack underneath and get all those both brackets on both sides lined up before you let the jack down. And then once you get those at least mostly tightened up, you should be able to let that down. And it stabilizes. And life is better. You can see where that 
spring was hammering on the frame for a little while till we could get it replaced so you could drive that way for a short while but I wouldn't drive it any further than you have to tighten them up and you're done alright George just tightened the bolts and you can see how we're level now Woo! we're not leaning anymore Good job, baby. Thank you, Robin. Yeah, thank you. Bye, y'all. <laughs> Bye, y'all.